hi guys welcome back to the channel i hope each and every one of you guys are doing well um if it's your first time seeing me my name is nadisha and i'm so glad that you are here with us today you know um i don't know what it is but i cannot get off the mary and joseph topic and i know tis the season okay tomorrow is christmas um but still though like the revelation is just it's coming it's, it's a lot so um Anyways, I kind of gave a similar message to this like a year ago um, around this time, but let's talk about it. You know, in scriptures, it says no weapons form against me shall prosper. You know, no weapons form against me shall prosper. Um, but God didn't say that the weapons weren't going to form, okay? The weapons were definitely going to form, but but basically God was saying it will not prosper. They will form, but it will not prosper. Even in the life of of jesus from birth okay and you know many many years before christ okay the prophets came and they they said what they said they prophesied that there will be a child that is born of a virgin right and he will be called emmanuel he will be the savior of the world okay and um so they had already said that from from the beginning right but despite everything that the prophets had said um king herod um did not care <laughs> he's like ah listen man uh what the, this child is born yeah sure um we need to take him out we need to get rid of um this light of the the world okay we need to get rid of the light of the world so he wanted to kill him okay and even for jesus some of you guys may feel like why is this battle so hard why do i have to fight so hard you know scripture says be the light and the salt of the earth but you need to understand that even jesus and his parents you know because he was he was a baby at the time had to fight you know it says it right here that um it says uh in matthew 2 verses 13 it says when they had gone, an angel of the Lord appeared to Joseph in a dream. Get up, he said. Take the child and his mother and ex escape to Egypt. Stay there until I tell you, for Herod is going to search for the child to kill him. Okay? So he got up, took the child and his mother during the night and left for Egypt. Okay? Okay? You need to understand that this all happened very quickly after the birth of Jesus, okay? So just imagine having a baby, females, those of you guys who've had a child, given birth, just imagine giving birth and then having to flee, okay? Because why? You're running for your life because crazy guy Herod wanted to kill Jesus, okay? So the weapons are going to form, the weapons are going to form, but they shall not prosper. Because based on the prophecy, it says that he will be the savior of the world. It had to be fulfilled. Prophecies have to be fulfilled. Herod did not get that memo. He was like, I don't care. I'm still going after him. Okay? So basically, God is saying, I gave you a prophecy. I gave you a promise. And because you are the light and you are the salt of the, the earth, that, and I've called you to be the light and the salt of the earth, you best believe there is some things that you're going to have to fight. There's some battles that you're going to have to fight. There's going to be some times where you're going to have to run. There's going to be some times where you have to flee to another state, to another country, to another neighborhood. Why? Because the battles are forming. The weapons are forming. But based on the pro prophecy that I've given you, based on the promise that I've given you, it shall not prosper. Another scripture says, no student is greater than their master. And if Jesus Christ is your master, you best believe because they persecuted him, they will persecute you as well. Because they rejected him, they will reject you as well. Okay, so this is Jesus. And they still had to flee. Okay? This is the Jesus. <laughs> this is the one. He was it. <laughs> you know, it, it was him. And they still had to flee. They still had to run for their life. They still had to fight. 
so that's why you also have to fight friend but nevertheless the weapons will form but they can't prosper they they it, it, it cannot prosper because you have a destiny okay so despite the weapons that are forming in your life right now think about the story of jesus think about the story of jesus yes they had to run and they had to run and leave and go to egypt but it was all good because they stayed at egypt it says this was also one of the the the, the warnings that they got you know, it says that stay stay in Egypt, stay in Egypt until I tell you what to do. And they stayed and uh, stayed in Egypt. And it says after Herod had died, an angel of the Lord appeared in a dream to Joseph, and said, "Get up, take the child and his mother, and go to a land of Israel, for those who were trying to take the child's life are dead." Okay, <laughs> see, we never have to fight our battles. Don't fight your battles give your battles to the lord because he is way better at fighting them than you okay and yeah herod died however herod died but it was when when herod died it was now safe for them to leave okay but you see they didn't move until they got instruction from the lord they they stayed put until an instruction was given to them okay so i encourage you guys to whatever it is that you're doing or you need to be doing don't 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 stay put <laughs> until you, god gives you instructions okay because what if they had left before they had gotten an instruction you know what i mean things would have just gotten a little a little interesting a little crazy right so nevertheless this was jesus the son of god and he still had to go through some some stuff okay and this is from birth <laughs> from birth okay he he just came on the planet and it, you know i can imagine mary being like hold up wait a minute so when gabriel had came to me and said what he said about me conceiving a child i didn't i didn't sign up for death i didn't sign up to be killed <laughs> you know why did i think this was going to be easy like you know what I mean? I can just imagine her being like, I didn't sign up for the, the killing, though. I, I just, I didn't sign up for all that, you know? That's not an easy job to be the mother of Jesus Christ. But anyways, that's a whole nother video. See, there goes more revelation. <laughs> that's for another video. But yeah, so this is the message. The weapons are going to form. They will form. They have to form because we live in a broken, fallen world with human beings who think they're gods. It will form, but they cannot, will not prosper. Hold on to your prophecy. Hold on to your promise. Whatever it is that God has said to you, it has to be fulfilled. Okay? Just like the story of Jesus. Okay? Stay in faith, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for liking and subscribing to the channel. Take care.